Hello again, so we have reached exercise uh, 13, which is uh, to calculate the sum of elements in an array. Um, so uh, we'll be using the same codes in exercise 11 and 12 to read and display an array. So we just need to write a function to uh, calculate the sum. So obviously, a sum to return a value is the sum. So it could be integer, uh, l l long, uh, if the array is of type integer, so we have the t and we have of course its size because we need to loop We need a variable sum uh, And we will initialize it to zero and a variable i for the counter So we will loop from zero uh, to n and we'll just uh, add to sum the value of t of i So this is it and I will return the sum the value of sum and in the main function, so I will remove all, so I will keep this, okay, and I will display the sum. So print f sum equal percentage d, and I will just uh, call, so I will need to call the sum. So here, sum of uh, t, so we have t, so we remove the bracket, and n, it's and this thing. So let's run. So let's enter four elements. So enter three minus four and one. So the answer, uh, there's one. So let's zero. So the sum would be equal to a zero. So this is for the uh, exercise 13. The exercise 14 is to call the function sum. So we need to do the same. So uh, just we need to combine all these into a test program. We've already done that. And let's move to exercise 15, which is to calculate the average of an array. So to calculate the average, so there's so either we can write a function average or we can use the sum. So the average, for example, here I can just re use printf here and say avg. So avg it's equal to sum over n. So sum it turns an integer and is an integer. So the answer is an integer. So there's a problem here. So I can cast one of these uh, uh, values to double, and of course I need to display. Uh, uh, the element so it's double so let's say 0.2 so this is one solution so let me just uh, so percentage to lf okay we have uh, here n so it doesn't recognize what uh, capital a means so let's enter 4 1 uh, 2 3 and uh, 4 so the sum is equal to 10 and the average is equal to 10 over 4, which is 2.5. Uh, or, or we can write again a function called average. So from the from the scratch, so it returns a double. And I will call it AVG. So we'll do the summation. And before doing that, before returning just the sum, I will return sum over n again here. So sum, uh, I can declare it double from the beginning. Or I can the same cast one of these variables. And I will call directly AVG. So I will keep this. And here I will call just AVG of TN. So the average. So let's rerun again. And yes, you will have the same average. So we have the option either to use a previously written uh, function or to rewrite the functions from scratch. So, and this is it for this uh, exercise. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to write to me. And of course, I will answer you back. And again, thanks for watching.